away from that. Vice President Professor Yemi Osimbajo says Nigeria needs a national debate to address the issues around the size of government and cost of governance in Nigeria. Osibajo said it is important to reduce the size of government to prevent wasting the resources meant for development on overheads, which he said is 70% of the country's revenue. Uh, the vice president said uh, those who would have to vote to reduce the cost of governance and the size of government are the same people who are benefiting from this current system. Mr. Osanbe. Sibajo um, is not um, telling us anything new. Hmm. Um, I don't think it has to do with um, just calling for a conversation or a debate on it. Hmm. Um, if we if we go back to 2014, when um, um, during the uh, confab, which was convened by Jonathan, um, we know that um, that confab tried to address the fundamentals that mm -hmm. affect this country, mm -hmm. and particularly the um, over the overheads mm -hmm. that um, the federal government is bearing, so to speak. Mm -hmm. So instead of calling for um, a conversation. Uh, I disagree with him to call for a conversation. Rather, we should go back to the Confag re report, which they, as soon as they came in, they dumped they in discarded. the bin. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, uh, and that is the bane of Nigeria's development. You know, uh, throwing away the baby with the bathwater. It doesn't really matter who who um, oversaw that Confab. What mattered to some of us was to look at the specifics and the, the, the good things in that confab report and see how you can implement them. What he's talking about now, three years to the end of their tenure, is what they should have addressed at the beginning. At the start of this administration. At the beginning. Okay. So it shows irresponsibility on their own part. Mm. It shows, you know, uh, th that they're careless. But having said that as well, uh, we must also know that um, governance in this country has become a tea party. Mm -hmm. He himself the president must ask themselves questions. They must start from, they must begin to show, lead by example. Mm -hmm. How many aides does he have as mm -hmm. vice president? Mm -hmm. What is he doing with them? The president, how many aides does he have? Mm -hmm. In each of the ministries, he has special assistants on, 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 that, on, that, on everything. On, on, on yes. everything. Mm -hmm. Don't you understand? Mm -hmm. um, uh, Abike Daribi, the, Dabiri is heading one agency, mm -hmm. and that agency is under Minister of Foreign Affairs. Mm. You have a Minister of Foreign, Foreign Affairs. Affairs already. And, and then in the Minister of Foreign Affairs, there's a department that, do, that deals with all that. Now, take for instance the President. Here is a President that has two special assistants on media. Hmm. Gal Bashew and the, the, other, the other character, mm. uh, Femi Adesino. Mm. So what is it that the two of them are doing that one person cannot actually do? That's mm. different from the personal assistants. Mm. The Vice President has SA photography. The president has two SA's photography. Hmm. I know them. Who are taking photos. Photos. Just I, photographs. I know, I know them. <laughs> Do you understand me? So what you, you, you've overpopulated you've overpopulated the place. And you so, are I mean, there's no the question, governance. really. Now, we are running a very expensive, very expensive. government. But, but, but yet again, uh, where Osibajo was going, and it was, it was trying to lay emphasis on legislature. Mm -hmm. So but some of us say, no, it's not just legis legislature. It equally includes, but not limited to the executive. Because the argument, if you look at what is being paid out to the legislators, mm -hmm. you know that so much is being wasted exactly. on these people. So it's mm -hmm. a question of, do we do part time. It's only in Nigeria that most politicians before they become a head of government of, I mean, they become uh, uh, elected, mm. they have no career. Mm. Nothing doing. You know, so and that is why they will do anything including, you know, dubious things to ensure mm. that they become what, you know, win the position that they, they are going, going for. So what we must now do, like Osibaji was trying to say, is to know whether we want, decide whether we want to have these as part-time legislators mm. so that you can be doing your job so you as patients can be a legislator and still mm. be a journalist that you are. Exactly. So, and when it's time to legislate, you, you find yourself to the National Assembly, mm -hmm. do your job. You do that and job and then get and back then meaning, meaning to... you're being paid as yeah. a part-time. Exactly. But sorry, it won't work mm. because his argument is that the same people who would sign this, who would propose this, are uh, still this, the same are people, people who are enjoying, they, they enjoy the, benefit the benefit of this. And yes. you can mm. imagine that the deputy senate president has over a hundred aides. <laughs> 
I know that. I have it on authority. Mm. Some of them are my friends. So what is he doing with Doing them? what? So these are areas of wastages. So it's not just goes to workers. Please, um, Peter, you have made a very valid point. Mm. Again, I hate when someone is in government and is speaking like opposition. That is the way this government has been acting. Mm. The vice president is not in opposition. He's in government. He's in government. You can't be in government and you are giving us a speech as if you are in opposition. That you are not in government. That if we were in government, we would have done this. What do you mean by debate over something that is under your nose? Why do you think that every known request that you send to National Assembly, they approve to you? Mm. They approve for you. Why don't you also send the same thing? Since the legislature and the executive are in the same bed. Mm. Why, why is this so difficult? Why are, we, why are we dispensing so much energy in discussing this? So for me, we need to discuss listen, this. Because, listen, let me tell you why we don't need to. Because okay. it's hypocrisy, as far as I'm concerned. It's hypocrisy. It's hypocrisy on the part of the government. On the part of the government. Okay. On the part of the government. Mm -hmm. All the things Mr. President said when he, he criticized during his campaign in 2014. He said, what are Jonathan doing with all the presidential jet in the Astro When he come, he doesn't even need more than one. Mm. Effective one. All the aircraft that he met are still there. He pay landing fee for them. He's repaying them. He's servicing them. Someone is becoming a billionaire by servicing those things. Mm. But you know, Mr. Ofosa, we need to talk about this because um, the future of the majority of Nigerians is hanging let, on let this, me, really. Tell you because why. our common we wealth are being wasted. We need to tell Mr. President that, mm -hmm. Mr. 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 Vice President that, you are in power. You don't need debate from anybody. You mm. have the power. Mm. You control the National Assembly, both lower and upper. Mm. You and your president, you guys have never quarreled. So you guys, are, you guys are in bed. To underscore what he has, what he has just said, <laughs> is that when, when <laughs> in the last um, um, uh, what, what are we talking it? about dispensation? Yeah, they said the, pro the reason why they were not able to or they've not been able to achieve anything. It was national assembly was, was not in national the assembly. National assembly was not in them. Now you have everything. You have everything. You have oh, wow. So what are you waiting? Like for? The, like the like the senior president said yes the, the other day about the Edo. He said they have the majority of governors. They have uh, national assembly. They have. Um, um, uh, um, executive. So what are you waiting for? Why don't you begin this crusade from inside before we begin to talk about debates? Mm. Talk okay. to yourselves. I mean, uh, th th this is something I think we need to look at keenly because this current um, uh, constitutional structure is not working, you know, as, uh, the, as it's where the, 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 the Oron Sae report, it's the Oron Sae report, mm. I don't know if you have read it, but find time to read it. Mm. Maybe you may have read ESAPS. The Ransai report is far reaching. Mm -hmm. It has said they should crash, merge some ministries, okay. dissolve some government agencies. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, that uh, are not uh, relevant. Uh, they're not relevant. Uh, that are that border on duplication. Exactly. So be begin to implement that. So in the process of implementing this, you, are, you now say you want to do more, mm. then we can be having that conversation. Mm. We are no longer ready to have that conversation. We are saying implement the. the it is that's that we already have. So I don't, know, I, don't know. I don't know. There's already a prototype by what which are, we can patient, go back. Patient, in but the, we're patient, not adopting it. Patient, so I don't patient, know what in else. In a normal mm. government, why would the vice president ask a aide that will issue a press, a press release for the same government? I'm asking myself. <laughs> I, I used to ask myself, why? I guess it's actually for first yeah, There is no time, about there this there is no time in Nigeria. But we have to go to there is no time in Nigeria mm -hmm. that we have a government and legislature that are so together like this. Okay, I get what you mean. I get what you mean. Talking about the rubber stamp <laughs> assembly, the Senate rather that we have been talking about, even though they do so, say they are not a rubber stamp Senate.